I just love Netflix. It says here, <clears throat> this might be the most life-changing article you have ever read, so be ready for your mind to be blown. For 9% of college students, Netflix is a way of life. It's what we rush through our homework for. It's our date on a Saturday night. It's our best friend when we are sick and lying in bed. My four-year relationship with Netflix has always been filled with good times and laughs, but recently I've started to lose interest and get bored. It seems as though I've seen every movie, rewatched every TV series twice, and can recite every documentary word for word. I even started cheating on my relationship with Netflix when I got on account for Hulu. Feeling terrible about my betrayal, I did some research to try to find a way to rekindle the flame with Bay Netflix. Last year, when I went on a trip to Mexico, I logged onto my Netflix account and something magical happened. I was greeted by my home screen, completely filled with new movies and TV shows that I had never seen before. This virgin Netflix was something only dreams are made of. It wasn't until recently that I figured out how to bring virgin Netflix to come to me in this U.S. aka Netflix's best keep secret. By taking your browser, you are able to log onto your Netflix from hundreds of different countries. This means new movies, new TV shows, chart not currently available to Netflix users in the United States, here are the steps. Download Google Chrome, and I go through these steps too. I can't even kind of see it. Google Ola, download the Google Ola extension. Go right hand side, you will see a fire symbol with a smiley face. Click on the happy fire symbol and you will be able to ch change the country you are browsing from. Now, since I know most people want to believe this, I've tested this by myself. And the way you go is that you go to uh, Google. Google, I'm working. Okay. You go to Ola. Okay, that's not Ola. Ola extension. Should bring you up to this. Com Web Store. You probably already have it, so you should add it to Chrome, which it already is to mine. So now you click Ola. And then there's actually going to be an unlock system which you must click. And now we are now browsing from the United States, and this is this is where it becomes magical. We now go to Netflix. I already had my account. We now go to this button, and we now click it. Most of you probably won't believe what I'm saying right now, but that's okay. So we go to click more. Let's do a good one. Um, uh, Australia. That's the first country I went to when I was amazed. Now I'm see, look, now browsing to Australia. Well, I just have to go. The only thing you have to do is sign in now. And then we'll show you my password because you don't know why. I was a little choppy in the beginning, but that's okay because, you know, different country. Now you just click sign in, as you normally would. And now you'll be greeted by the same greet and sign. Now just watch. Just watch, okay? Be mind blown. Okay, one second. The Avengers, age of all time. Are you effing kidding me? Look at this. Age of all time. I've already tested out all the movies. They're all perfectly fine. Oh, it's not any work. Okay, we got Jackass. And then we also have Vikings. Look at some of the stuff you get here. Shadowhunters, weekly. Um, Tomorrowland. No, it's a good movie. Bunch of TV shows too. You look at these two.
Now I'm not going to show you each and every show, but let me just say, if this guy, most of you don't trust it, and I know I didn't trust it either. But really? Come on. Please give it a shot. Like, look at all the classic little kid movies. It's like, I can stretch through this all day and show you all the great movies. But yeah, if you don't believe me, tell me in the comments below. And if you liked the video, please give it a like and I will see you later. Peace.